Northwood fans, after a big win with the women's basketball, 76-54 for Saginaw Valley. We're joined now by women's head coach Jeff Curtis. And coach, we were just talking, uh, almost a 180 from the last time you played those guys. They beat you pretty bad over there, and you returned the favor tonight. Yeah, we did. Rivalry game. Um, you know, I, you can look at it any way you want. They absolutely destroyed us at their place, and I was very proud of our team's effort tonight to be able to, to turn the tables in and get the win at home. And uh, like we were saying, it was almost a carbon copy of the game, just different outcome tonight. So uh, it was good to see our team play a full 40 minutes, and they, I thought we really executed well, and it was a great team win for us. Yeah, you look at the field goal percentage, something you guys are really struggle with, 45% tonight, really. I mean, shoot 45%, you score 76 points, not rocket science, and you guys did a good job offensively tonight. I really felt we did. We we were able to get the ball where we wanted it. We were able to execute our half-court offense, and I, I thought our transition was really good tonight. We got the ball out, capitalized on a lot of their turnovers, and uh, you know, that's, again, you mentioned it, it's not rocket science. When you shoot a high percentage from the floor, you, you're going to score some points, and I thought, for us anyway, that's how we need to play. We need to turn our defense to you know get turnovers, um, force them into some tough situations, taking tough shots, and then and then flip the table on that, and get some transition on offense. So we did that tonight. We executed really well, and I think the the score shows that. Rachel Church had uh, 16 points tonight, four or five from three, but she hit four in the first half. And but ultimately, really, what that did is it opened up things for you in the second half. They really had to guard her tight, and it, and we've been saying that all year that it should open up for things for everybody else, and it really did tonight. Yeah, and, and teams are going to go out and guard Rachel like that, and she is a great three-point shooter. Um, holds every record here. So um, great to see her go out uh, the way she did, too, to have a great game. Um, it's probably the most complete game she played all year long. Shot the ball well, defended pretty well. Um, you know, just couldn't be more happy for a senior. Yeah, but you also had some Gab Brevet, your point guard. 17 points, four rebounds, four assists, four steals, two turnovers. When a point guard plays like that, it's very tough to beat a team. It is, and quite honestly, when Gab's had games like that, we've been pretty tough to beat. And uh, she's done a great job all year. Um, you know, she's improved. And if you look at her numbers this year compared to last year, there was a big jump. And hopefully, there'll be another big jump there for her in the future. I think Gab's a great point guard, and she does a great job commanding the offense, getting the ball where it needs to go. And um, yeah, those stats are pretty impressive tonight. Looking forward to next year, you guys got uh, almost everybody, Nellie Smith, Rachel Church are gone, but almost every other core player will be back. So, I mean, the future is very bright for Northwood women's basketball. Yeah, I think it is, too. And, and before I dive into that, too, I just want to say, you know, Nellie did a great job tonight, too, being a senior. Uh, put into the starting lineup for the first time in her career at Northwood. Uh, actually, second time. She had one game uh, last year. But I thought she played a great game tonight, played with a lot of energy, took care of the ball, did some good things for us. And uh, I couldn't be more happy for her as well. But as looking forward to the future, you're right. I mean, we returned 16 of 18. And uh, we've got a good core group of younger players that are going to be more veteran players now and a great recruiting class coming in. So I think the future is very bright. We're, we're looking forward to it. Should be a good time. 76-54, Northwood finishes the season with the win. Coach, it's really nice to do this interview with you, and congratulations. Thanks, I appreciate it. And thank you for watching.